Welcome back. Now, African football officials say hosting the 16-team African Nations Championship is important in attempting to reclaim normalcy after a devastating year for the sport. At the ongoing competition in Cameroon, teams and fans have not been spared the blow of the virus. A CGTN Sadiq Shaban now reports from Cameroon. There's been a lot of conversation and discussion about hosting the delayed 2020 African Nation Championship in the middle of a global outbreak of COVID-19 pandemic around the world. The DR Congo team is one of the teams in this competition that has been hardest hit by the virus. More than 15 players and officials of the DR Congo team spent days in isolation and treatment over a period of three weeks after they tested positive for COVID-19. At one point, CAF intervened after fears that the DR Congo team wanted to withdraw from the tournament over testing controversy. I don't want to talk about the politics of testing of COVID. My players and I have recently recovered from the virus, but as you know, we are perhaps the most tested team in the competition because of the challenges we have had. Football fans were allowed access into the match venues. Organizers sold only 30% of study capacity and tickets were quickly snapped up. Inside the stadium, regular disinfection was carried out before matches. In Cameroon, football is like opium. Football is a religion. Football is the people's daily living. So when you have a competition in Cameroon and you don't have the people in the stadium, they are sick. The COVID has made, has spoiled the chant. CAF had published extensive regulation targeting crowd control and fans' welfare before the tournament. Health officials conducted temperature screening ahead of mostly evening matches. As a DR Congo fan, I think that they used the COVID-19 to eliminate our team. Why was it that only our players tested positive every time? And why different numbers all the time? The efficiency of the testing is questionable. Uh, it is not easy, but uh, there is medical aspect of COVID-19 and there is mental aspect of COVID-19. So in mental aspect, we are helping with playing this tournament to give people hope that life could eventually in the future return back to normal. For those who attended the match, this was the mood inside the facility. We are happy that the President of the Republic has made it possible for this competition to finally come to Cameroon. We are happy and jovial to see the game return to Cameroon and to celebrate together. Meanwhile, protocol officials took no chances with the members of the media after several cases of COVID-19 were reported at the tournament. They threw a ring round the teams and employed orderlies to enforce social distancing between the press and the players. The Confederation of African Football says the 2020 African Nation Championship in Cameroon will provide a platform for further discussion as football around Africa and around the world continues to recover from the outbreak of COVID-19. Sadiq Shaban, CGTN, at the Japoma Stadium in Douala, Cameroon.